can be happening. Mama, no. You know the curse. No one can leave or everyone in the holler will explode into dust. And you're allergic. I can't be dreaming. So the heart she holler. I don't know how to explain this, you know, you know, in the lexicon no, I of don't TV. I don't either. You know, they gotta look back at like if aliens found this, what would you think they would think about this show? Especially like let's just let's just say the you know, for, the first six episodes. The first, yeah, what would they think about them? What would they think when they saw that? Tame. This might be tame for them if they were aliens. That's what you said, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah. It might be just like you know a day in the in the life of their world. All right, now the average American, if they, an average American who didn't know about Adult Swim or anything, came into a room, this came. <laughs> they shouldn't watch it. It's no, it's um, it's it's kind of terrifying. I mean, it's it's an incredible um, force, and I don't, you know, it's it's a certain uh, taste that you might like, but if you don't, it can be kind of um, wicked. And, and in some senses, I feel like. Maybe they should put it on in mentally institutionalized facilities to make them feel more at home. Yeah, it's like, such like hearing things from inanimate objects. That's right. No, I think that would be actually a really good, um, a really good audience. They would feel calmed, and um, and maybe yeah, I think that that might be our new our new market is the insane. The mental institution, isn't that what you just said? Yeah. Okay. Uh, is there anything you aim for when you're with, uh, you know, when, when you guys are shooting? Of course, you shoot really fast, and um, that that you guys want to up the ante, I guess, is the is the thing. Do you guys try to up the ante? I mean, the writing alone is pretty insane, but do the actors try to up it at all? I don't know. I think if you just kind of um, the writing exactly is is one of those really. Um, you have to commit just to say some of these things, and so you don't really want to overthink it too much. You just kind of go in and, and go full throttle. I feel like that's that's the fun part. Is there any one line when you're reading the script and everything that you go, "This is the, what is the line?" You go, "I'm, I'm doing this." Um, no, I can't even. I truly is. You can say whatever. No, no, but I don't. This it was a line that I can't ever imagine repeating. Um, even in that moment, I, I just had to kind of dive in and say it, and I'm not going to ever say it again. So, yes, there is a line. There's church Sunday. Sunday's a, another Sunday is coming up. Um, it's a Monday through Monday situation. I would never want to say it again. <laughs> All right, well, I'm sure they can uh, they can find that line and maybe to get guests to it as well. Yeah. All right, well, uh, season two, are we looking forward to more uh, insanity, I guess? I think, yeah. Um, my. I feel like my character took her whole rage a hall to a whole another level, and that was really awesome and fun. Like, just she just kind of, um, I feel like she completely came unraveled. So it was really, I mean, it was a joy to, to be able to just go for it, and because um, there's no other situation where I can be that wild. Do, uh, do the sets themselves, even you know, they're not a, a, a huge, huge extravagant sets. Do they kind of put you in the mindset of the insanity? Absolutely, yeah. I mean, the sets are so incredibly beautiful, and it is just a <laughs> mind. It's a, a total mind voyage. So, um, so yeah, you just have to get in in the moment and be present and just like enjoy the whole insanity. I think. I mean, even watching it, maybe that's the case. Well, insanity is what we're looking for. So, thank you very much. We'll keep watching. Thank, thank you. you.